today. Morning. Welcome to the Bilser Show, eh? It's freaking right, boys. Girls, peoples. Today, it's a driving to work video. It's freaking right. First of all, I'd like to start off by saying, holy dicks, that sun's bright. Wow. First of all, I want to start out by saying, happy anniversary, babe. Freaking right. We're going out for dinner tonight, and we're going to have a good time here. Decent. Second of all, El New Capo. Not quite as good as the other one, but... She stayed warm all day yesterday, so she passes a Bilsa's challenge. Friggin' great right it does. Careful! Easy. Careful. Get stuff rolling all over the damn place in here. What's really going on? Hey, anybody ever try that uh, Pepsi Mango before? It's decent. Give her a shot. Tell me what you think. Why wouldn't you? So I got a little story for you. I do. And some of you already know what it probably is because a lot of you are on my Bilsa facebook page if you're not on my facebook page look up bilsif on facebook and you'll find me freaking right you will but i'm gonna tell you a story and it's pretty funny so my house is on the end of the street and there's a access this way and an access this way to access the cable boxes or whatever whatnot so i took the fence down at the back of my yard because there's another fence and another fence i have to cut the grass in the alley so I figured I'll just take my fence down and then I'll cut the grass. It'll be easier to do it. Decent, right? So we got the dog. The dog kept getting out and this and that and the other thing. So I made a swing gate that just swings open or the shut. It swings either way just to stop the dog from going out of the, the yard, right? So it kind of, it, it does block the alley, but it, it's movable. It's a swing gate. So I put one on both sides. They both turn like this and whatnot and this and that and the other thing. Someone complained the alley is blocked. Meanwhile, I'll throw a picture in here right now. This is what's on the other side of the gate in the alley. So my question to you is, how the hell are you going to walk through it anyways? Frick sakes. What a bunch of friggin' whiners in this world anymore. I'll tell you, boys, girls, peoples. If somebody can bitch about something, they're going to find it. But if I find out who the hell was bitching about it, I'm going to make your life a living friggin' hell I am. So you better hope I don't find out who you are, because if I find out who you are... You're not going to like me anymore. Because if all you can do is bitch about something like that, then you have a boring life. Friggin' right you do, you friggin' loser. Okay? If you want to walk through, all you got to do is turn the gate, walk through. I don't care. I never bitch about anything to anybody. Some of you could be doing something real shady, and I wouldn't bitch about it. I don't give two shits what people are doing. Wow. You can come sit in my backyard on a lawn chair and I wouldn't care. Just come out and say, how you doing? What are you doing? That's it. Oh, right on. Want a coffee? Pop? Want anything? I guess not everybody's as easy as going as me, though, eh? Everybody's a bunch of tight, wad, freaking worked up clown bubbles. And I act like I'm worked up, but really I'm not. Eh? Makes good content when you act worked up, it does. Okay, I'm a little worked up, okay? Stop teasing me, for freak's sakes. Coffee, drink them if you got them, boys. Vape them if you got them, boys. Or smoke them if you got them. Still in the vapes. No ciggies. I'm going to shave. Leave the comments below if you think you should know where to take Stacy for dinner tonight. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification bell bar button, too. And I know I'm going to get comments down there saying, you shouldn't block the alley anyways. It's your own fault. But hey, whatever. Right? What the frick ever? I didn't block the alley. It's a freaking gate. Push it open lazy pricks. So I'll leave it open for a week or so and then I'll close it back up again. I left Al a nasty message yesterday on his phone though. They gotta come by. So he'll probably call me today. Maybe I'll put him on speakerphone if he does if I have my camera handy. Because I got a busy day ahead of me here. There's a lot going on. I haven't much stopped. Boys, I'm gonna have to hire some help so pay for the road. Not that busy yet. Close though. We have our days we do. But the old gold glass accessory in the is uh, it's working out pretty good. It is. Not a bad little gig, boys. We're running some great by him. A right? little great bitch action. Ah, hi. But it's Friday. For great it is. Hopefully everybody's having a good day and going to enjoy their Friday. We'll get her over as fast as we can, we will. It's a long weekend. A hey, Labor Day weekend, boys. Something like that. I think it's Labor Day. Summer's gone. Holy. Holy. Where the hell it go? I don't even remember summer. It was a blur. I wonder why I didn't have many videos out, because I don't even remember summer. Trailer for sale, boys. Well, that little, little trailer. You didn't see it, did you? Frick, no, you didn't. Looks like about a four by eight, boys, with wooden sides. Almost looks like a tent trailer. It is a tent trailer frame, I think. Hey, 
He did a nice job refurbing it, he did. Anybody's looking for a trailer? Confederation Street at McDonald. There you go. Fire up, boys. Fuck by two, why wouldn't you? How you doing, Jamie? Hey, how you doing, bud? He's been bugging me because I haven't been doing any driving around videos, so I have to shout you out. Good old Jamie from J, &J Body Shop, eh? If you're in J, &J Body Shop, say, Bill just said hi, why wouldn't you? I'm sure you ain't better. I dedicate this driving around video to you, bud. Drive to work with Belson. Great yard. I don't know what I should call this video. What do you think I should call this video? Cocked over? I wish I could. Then they'll freaking flag it. See, that's why I never call my videos cocked over. Are we done yet? Any time to go home yet? I'm not even to work yet. I want to go home. That's really good. Cool. Today we've got four or five windshields and accessories. The lights are on for the school. Why are they on? Why are the lights on for the school? It's not September yet. Don't rush it, eh? Turn your damn lights off. Why wouldn't you? Got myself a Peterbilt to do today, and Navistar, this, that, and the other freaking thing. It's only 7.30. Oh, I gotta go see Jamie first thing this morning, too, to put a quarter window back in on Lexus. So I'm gonna see you this morning, bud. I was gonna come back last night, but I got halfway back with a window, and I forgot up my freaking toolbox at the shop, and had all my primers and everything else in, so I turned around again, and by that time, it was 20 after 4, and I'm done at 4.30, so I was like, Yo, I'll be tomorrow. All right, well, see you in the morning there, Jim Bob. But anyways... I didn't want to give you an update on that and see what you think of that. Like I said, leave your comments below and let me know what you think of the alley thing. Like, I cut it. I cut the grass from the alley. Maybe I should just let it grow up over the fence. Our responsibility to cut the alley, to maintain the alley. But yet, if you do one thing they don't like and they're all over you. I should send them a bill for my gas for the lawnmower. Because it's not a small alley, for freak's sakes. It's like five or six strips in length of my yard. Five or six strips in length of the backyard. Frank, take it off my taxes. Why wouldn't you? But anyways, have a good day. Enjoy your Friday. And we'll see you next time on the Dirty Old Belson Show. Friggin' right we will. So, you know what to do for now. So, what are you doing, bud? Yeah, hey, we're just playing around with a Ford. Are you? Are you putting in some new electricals? Did you already get yeah. it in? Yeah, I got her in. Look at this guy go, eh? See, it's true. The bosses do work. We try sometimes. Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? Tell them what to do. 